Hey, welcome to the weekly takeaway. So today we're talking about humanizing your brand. Marketing has changed a lot in the almost 20 years that I've been in this industry. Um, Humanizing people to people marketing, human to human marketing, um, you know, showing up on stories, giving behind the scenes tours, um, sharing family anecdotes were never ever a thing when I first started out. And it took me a long time to shift my own mindset in regards to how that um, can help to represent your business in a positive way, in a professional way. Um, and it really does all boil down to your brand personality and how it's being um, translated. However, if you are afraid to show your face on your socials, if you do not have an image or about section on your website, you are going to fall behind because people connect with people and that's how you build trust, which then leads to sales. So, um, you, people are really more likely to purchase from a person, someone that they can relate to, somebody that they want to support. Um, and it really is about build, building that connection. So in branding, we talk about points of difference. And yes, your product or your service will always have, you know, a slightly different spin. It will, you know, stand out differently compared to a competitor but there's one thing that will never ever be able to be copied and that people will be naturally drawn to and that is you and you are your own point of difference regardless of all of the other marketing jargon that's out there. Um, So highly encourage you to do that first intro post, introduce yourself on your Instagram or your Facebook stories Um, send out an email to your subscriber list telling them a personal anecdote and asking to share one back. And that is how you humanize your brand. If you would like more of these weekly takeaways directly to your inbox, please subscribe via the link below. Have a great week.